<laughs> it looks like Squirrel Stampede is going to try to review the Disney Pixar The Good Dinosaur Miniature Collection. <laughs> he will fail, as you need to have much raptor intelligence. <laughs> that is right, you need to be very smart and quick on your toes. Here, watch this. <laughs> <laughs> Look at me, I'm a tiny velociraptor, and I can review these toys better than Squirrel Stampede. <laughs> but wait, now your brains are very tiny and small. How will you do this? <laughs> I am intelligent. I wrote down all the notes on my tiny hands. <laughs> Wait a second, I can't read them, they're, they're so tiny I can't see. Oh no, how do I get back to my normal form? I'm so tiny I don't, I don't remember how. Uh, uh, oh no, what am I going to do? Uh, uh, uh. Uh, going backwards, here is the Disney Pixar The Good Dinosaur 25 character World of Dinosaurs collection cylinder. Nothing is more fun than little plastic dinosaurs. How dare you! One thing I like about these right away is the color scheme and softness of how all these little dinosaurs look. They really feel unique in the world of miniature dinosaur collecting. Hold on, Hold on a, a second! second. <laughs> this is not fair! Jurassic World dinosaurs have been stored in their package all summer long. Why you no lever look at us? But oh, The Good Dinosaur comes out, a movie you haven't even seen yet, and you want to play with them? But what about us? We are Walmart exclusives from Jurassic World, one of the, one biggest, of the biggest movies, movies ever, ever made. made. How come we don't? Okay guys, just calm down. Maybe we'll look at you too, okay? Oh, you better! Oh, 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 oh. So anyhow, let's pop this thing open and check out some of the dinosaurs we are going to see in The Good Dinosaur. Nice little carry handle, by the way, on this for getting around town. Uh, let's open this up with an X-Acto. Probably should have your parents do this or just pick the tape off like any normal person would. All right, dinosaurs, woo! Come on out, guys. All right, so we have a bunch of dinosaurs here on the table. Uh, where do we begin with these guys? Uh, maybe I'll start with the heavier ankylosauruses. Is that what you call them, Ankly, ankyliosauruses? My dinosaur trivia is a little off today. We get three of them. And in the movie, I think one of them is called Vivian, but I'm not sure yet. Uh, the plastic on these is a really hard plastic, so they're not really soft. Eh, there's a little bit of bend to them for a plastic dinosaur. But again, I really like how soft these are. They kind of feel like that Pixar animated style, uh, obviously, because that's what the toy is for. Uh, but yeah, a totally different uh, dinosaur to goof around with. And we get a nice yellow, green, and brown one of these. I'm sensing a theme here, but it looks like we're going to get one dinosaur in three different colors, the brown, lime green, and dark green. And here is the Stegosaurus, one of my favorites in the dinosaur world. Very fun little Stego. I like his cute little head uh, on there and the little uh, spikes coming off his tail. And again, very soft. Looks like we're going to get four pterodactyls, tetradons, uh, petrodons, whatever you want to call them. They have several names now uh, because of the several styles that have been uh, popularized and dug up and all that sort of thing. Uh, these are all white, a kind of a, a grayish white color and a uh, little pointy on the beaks, a really fun one. These often are a tough dinosaur toy to make because they never stand up and they did a really good job using their wings as uh, feet to keep them upright. So score points on that for those guys. Next up must be the Velociraptor or Troodon character, perhaps. Uh, we've got two gray ones and two dark gray characters of these guys. And they also look really well and also stand up really well for as tiny as they are. You can, these guys look at the size of my hands next to them. They're really a spindly plastic, but they hold up really well. Uh, so these might be my favorites so far in the pack of dinosaurs. 
Now because The Good Dinosaur is a what if movie where there is the dinosaurs had never uh, been destroyed by the asteroid or whatever caused their extinction, we also have mammals of course in the movie and it looks like this is the only set of uh, what would these be, Texas Longhorn oxen of sorts uh, or buffalo guys. Uh, also in the green, lime green, and brown. So kind of a fun mixture to have in this pack uh, to mix it up a little bit. So we have three Triceratops in the pack, and this one definitely looks like a character from the movie. I'm not sure of his or her name yet, but a lot of birds are usually perched up on all those horns. I believe one of them is named Sam, I'm not sure, it was a blue trike in one of the toy packs and we'll know more about this as we go on. And if you're watching this video in like say 2018 and we're all just like, I know everything about the good dinosaur and the five sequels, uh, then you can uh, kind of put down a comment of who it is. It looks like we have three T-Rex-ish versions of the T-Rex and I think the center one is Butch. It's really tricky, both of these guys look really similar so I believe the one with a little more uh, facial expression of sharpness is Butch, but I'm not completely sure. And I believe this is Ramsey. Ramsey is a little thinner than the other two there, so we'll know more again about these soon. But they do look cool, and again, they stand up very well. And finally, and most importantly, we have Arlo and what could be Arlo's dad, or maybe an adult version of Arlo, not sure yet, but this is the uh, prize of the collection. Obviously, for a main character, the collection tube is about $9.99, so if you, all you want is this little Arlo, it's going to cost you 10 bucks. Uh, but you know what, it might be worth it with all those other dinosaurs included really like how they've got so much character in just such a little piece of plastic. So there are your 25 characters of the good dinosaur mini dinosaur figures. These are really fun. I like these a lot and are great value. Plus you can take them anywhere you want to go. So they're probably one of the better toys to pick up if you're going to start collecting the good dinosaur toys. Hold on a second. You said you would look at us. All right, let's take a look at you two real quick. Thank you. So yes, indeed, the Jurassic World Miniature Dinosaurs 15 pack Walmart exclusive, as you would see on store shelves, has been pretty much stuck in a box all summer, missing the table several times. There's various ways of collecting the miniature dinosaurs from Jurassic World, but I think this way is the best getting them all in a bag, plus you get the exclusive Indominus Rex. These dinos are in a resealable bag, but I think I prefer the plastic container of the good dinosaur, a little more fun and durable. Spilling the contents of this bag out, we get many 15 dinosaurs, some in cardboard protectors. Okay, here are the 15 dinosaurs. Wait, are there 15? Yes, 15 dinosaurs, and these are a little larger uh, than the good dinosaurs that you can see. These are about maybe half the size of the good dinosaurs, or is it the other way around? Twice the size of the good dinosaurs. Uh, we've got a little more painted approach with these, and uh, got a good assortment. Uh, so let's uh, try to uh, sort these guys out really quick here. I think I see two Stegosauruses to start off. But yeah, two very pointy uh, Stegosauruses, and nicely painted uh, with their scales and plates on their backs. Uh, a different color than the green and the brown of the main dinosaur. Also, we have an actual Jurassic World sculpted letters coming off of their legs, which is really great because if you collect a lot of uh, different various dinosaurs in your life, you will always be able to know which ones are your Jurassic World dinosaurs. Let's see, I see one Triceratops. This one is not as painted as, say, the others, a really kind of a gray, but there's some yellow eyes on her. I see one Pachyosaurus, is it Pachyosaurus? I can't remember with the uh, bone head that they like to smash together. This one's a golden uh, with a little bit of red going down her back and she stands not so well. <laughs> kind of tippy. Sometimes these toys you can bend their legs just a little bit 
and they'll start standing on you, but often they kind of bend back, so you gotta just kind of play. Right now she's working well. Ooh, the Spinosaurus, one of my favorites from Jurassic Park 3. Uh, this one's a gray dino with a green going down her back. Uh, really fun one here, and she stands well with her uh, good flat feet. Next up is the Mosasaurus, and I think we have two, two Mosasauruses here. And one is kind of a gray with a blue stripe, and the other is a, a kind of a green, a brown green with a green stripe going down her back. Uh, these are fun to have. I'm really glad to see some water dinosaurs included with the pack. Ooh, a golden T-Rex. Uh, absolutely love it. It's uh, the status of the T-Rex these days. Uh, round for a long time, so she gets a nice gold look. Looks fun, kind of even shiny on her. Then another Ankylosaurus, uh, really sharp bony plate on the back. Pretty much one color. Well, no, we got a lighter a tan belly on her. She's kind of in a cool stance, I like that. Really kind of lizard-like, uh, I like that. That's cool. Looks like we've got maybe one Pterodactyl Petrodon and one, oh shoot, what do they call these? Dim something. Uh, it looks like a mix. They were playing around with different dinosaurs in the movie and we had kind of a mixture of a flying dinosaur or something, I believe. Or if I'm completely off on that, let me know, but that's what I kind of thought. Um, but this one's a lot bigger. This one's more standard, your typical uh, pterodactyl like a flyer. Then we get a velociraptor. Unfortunately, we only have one velociraptor with this pack. Doesn't look like it's blue. We don't have a blue stripe down her back. Uh, so it could have been one of the others uh, in the movie. They're also just green. Kind of one of the things I didn't like about the movie is they're all just similar looking. Uh, but this girl here is a gray with a light gray going down her back. Very similar to the, the large action figure toy pose in that common velociraptor attack. And it looks like we've got the Indominus Rex. Um, we've got two different versions of her. One white and blue like we would see in the movie, but I guess you could say this is a camel version of her in the trees and such. Uh, but I'm surprised we got two in the package. And she's holding up pretty well, not falling over or anything. Uh, about the same size though as, as the other dinosaurs in the pack. It would have been nice had they increased her size just a little bit more. Oh, and then there's this guy. Who is this guy? And finally, those are the 15 dinosaurs you get in the Walmart Jurassic World Dinosaur Pack. Well worth the, I think about 10, 12 bucks, pretty good value. And that is your Disney Pixar The Good Dinosaur Miniature Dinosaur Collection Pack. A pretty good value overall with 25 dinosaurs to play with. Each one of them a little bit different for the most part. Lots of fun characters involved with this series. Find these fall 2015, that's what I have to say about that. Squirrels can run circles around little plastic dinosaurs. Thanks for watching Squirrel Stampede. <laughs> Has anyone here seen my resizification machine? <laughs> I would really like to get back to my form. <laughs> I, I don't like being this small. <laughs> oh, oh, this is awful.